Ready? And action. Mm-hmm. I was talking to my boy and Jesse the other day, and he told me that guy that got shot last night, well, he was given a week to get back some money, y'all, that he had owed to the big-time dealer that runs several blocks. But from what I was told, this guy even controls a lot of downtown deals that he takes his big-time clients product directly. Girl, bye. He was robbed last month, and they had him for 20 dollars that could be a closed house, if y'all know. That the bill dealer gave yesterday to get some money back. Oh, the liquor's moving. That boy was a good boy. And I don't believe for a moment, okay, that he was caught up, that Londo was caught up into drugs. Mm-mm. That boy is the mother of my brother's best friend. And I don't believe for a minute that he was doing something like that. Listen, whether you a dealer or an innocent victim, he still somebody's son. That's true. People act like you get shot because you deserve to get shot. And heaven help you if you just try and die. The community and the press want to paint you as somebody who only lives to bring the community down. Hmm. Someone right here in this small group knows someone who knows someone that shot that young man. We are a community, but nobody wants to say anything. I ain't saying nothing. Say anything? You mean like say something? Uh-huh. Girl, are you talking about snitching? I ain't snitching, girl. I ain't snitching. I'm a diva. Uh, are you I'm crazy? Snitching? Mm -hmm. snitching? For all we know, that boy that got killed was shot down because he ran his mouth. Look, if we want things to change around here, then we have to do something. Those people who are running around shooting people, are a small group of individuals who are holding our community hostage by gunpoint. Well, there's one thing I know for certain, and that's I'm not saying nothing. I don't hear nothing, I don't see nothing, and I ain't saying nothing. Mm -hmm. Me too, mm -hmm. Shay. Shay, I can't believe that you wouldn't say anything if you knew who shot Landell. Listen, I wouldn't wish this on anybody. It, it's just like, do you know how that feels like? It's like somebody had just cut that baby right out of your stomach. That's the pain that I wouldn't. Mm. Girlfriend, you got a problem. You need to eat Okay, the Lord watches over all of us. And you're not going to die for your time. The Bible tells us that it's pointed unto a man once he died oh, and then the judgment. Come on now. <laughs> so it must have been judgment time for Lindell. Oh, stop it, Diva. <laughs> for running off with the big time drug dealer's money. That's not funny. That is funny. That no, is it's cold mm -hmm. and that is heartless. Mm -hmm. It's funny, honey. You and that minister of that church got mm -hmm. something in common. Whatever, like what? A heart of stone. I do have a heart. I don't know what's worse. These drive-by killings or the drive-by attitudes of people like Dr. Reverend Pastor Minister Johnson, who's probably more concerned with the blood on his sidewalk than the life that was lost.